Hey there people, it's Danny from Concha Calisthenics. Sorry about any background noise, it's very windy and there's a lot of trees about, so there's not much that I can do about that. I'm just doing the best that I can do. So a lot of people have been asking me on my one year calisthenics body transformation video is what workout program was I using over the year to actually completely transform my body. And if you haven't seen that video, I'll put a link for the video up above. And what I will say is when I first started out, I was just doing some crunches and some other different exercises just sporadically. So I might just train for about 15 minutes um, every single day for a while. Well, that's what I was doing, should I say. And then I started doing loads of research into how to actually correctly can train with calisthenics to actually maximize muscle growth and really get the body goals that I wanted to in the shortest period of time. So then I started watching a lot of different calisthenics YouTube channels videos, more specifically Chris Herrier on Thenex, which I'm sure the majority of you are aware of him if you are into calisthenics, because yeah, he was part of the Bar Stars team and he's like one of the best calisthenics athletes out there and he used to do competing and he's just absolutely amazing. I still watch him to this day. So I started watching his workout videos and started following his workouts but what I will say is I followed them for a while and then I just started feeling that they weren't meeting my needs so I started modifying them and then I'll stick to those modified versions for a while and then I just started creating my own workout programs so I would say the majority of the duration of my one year transformation I was actually creating my own workout programs and yeah, the ways that I just did this was I just worked out which body parts that I wanted to train, researched into all different calisthenics exercises online. And then what I would do is for each different workout, so if I was doing an ab workout, I would always use six exercises and I'd always do three rounds. And if I was doing legs, it would be the same, six different exercises and three rounds. And the same with upper body as well so it really is as simple as that and a lot of people find it's very difficult to create their own workout programs and a lot of people keep asking me do I have a workout program that I can share with people and what I say is I haven't yet but I am in the process of creating my own in the near future so stay tuned for that if you want to be notified of when it becomes available go to my website consciouscalisthenics.com that I put a link for down below and you can sign up to the newsletter there and you'll be notified of when it comes up. But until that becomes available, you can look at my workout videos. I have a few of them on my YouTube channel and I'll put a link down below for a playlist that has all the different workout videos that I've created so far and I will create more and put them on this YouTube channel so stay tuned for those in the near future. And for me, the reason why I love creating my workout programs is because yeah, it can be specifically made for me and also I find after doing a specific workout program for a while the body starts to adapt so you don't get as greater benefits from it so I find every three to four weeks of doing the same workout I will then create a new workout with different exercises to get my muscles to actually work in different ways than it has been doing with the other exercises that it's become adapted to. And at the same time, creating these new workouts has always kept me interested because just doing the same one over and over again can sometimes get very, very boring for myself and many other people as well. And what I would say is it doesn't matter what workout program you're using out there, just find one that is suitable for you or create your own and stick to it consistently and make sure that you are pushing your body to the limits. You can maximize the muscle growth because if you're not pushing your muscles to the limit, then you're not tearing the muscle fibers as much as possible and then they're not gonna grow as much as possible because the more that you tear them, the more that they grow whilst you're resting and repairing your muscles after your workouts. So that's something to just be very, very aware of. So that's it for this video. If you have any questions, leave them down below. I'll get back as soon as possible. I love answering your questions. If you like the video, like down below, give us a thumbs up, and please share this video with anyone that you think would love to learn about what I actually did with my training and changing my body in one year with calisthenics and whether I used a workout program or not. 
And if you haven't already, click that subscribe button down below to receive a lot more videos from me on a regular basis. And the type of videos that you can expect to get from me are on topics such as calisthenics, intermittent fasting, eating one meal a day, eating a plant-based diet. Also, there's gonna be so many videos following this one talking about all the different things that I did to maximize my one year transformation that I've managed to gain and maintain because there's so many people asking so many different questions and all the different questions that people are leaving on it, I will make videos for them as soon as possible to answer those questions that I'm sure a lot of people would like to know the answers to. So if those type of videos sound good to you, make sure you click that subscribe button down below and you click the bell notification button next to the subscribe button, otherwise YouTube will not notify you of when new videos are uploaded. So as always, stay fit, stay energetic, and go and get those gains. Peace.